This is a video on hypothesis tests and p-values. The question states, the speed limit on Oak Street is 50 miles per hour. The California Highway Patrol suspects that cars on average exceed the speed limit. They perform a hypothesis test with alpha equals 0 0.1 and come up with a p-value of 0 0.07. State the two hypotheses, interpret alpha and p, and state the conclusion. So let's start out with the null hypothesis. Notice we want to find out if the average speed exceeds the speed limit. So average is the mean, or in this case, our null hypothesis, H naught, is that mu, the mean, is equal to 50, because that's the speed limit that we're testing to see if the average speed exceeds 50 miles per hour. So now let's find the alternative hypothesis. The key word here is exceed. The word exceeds is the same as the word greater than. So our alternative hypothesis is that the mean, mu, is greater than 50. So next we need to interpret our alpha. Alpha is 0 0.1, and alpha is always a probability of a type 1 error, or the probability that we reject the null hypothesis when in truth the null hypothesis is correct. So we interpret alpha by saying there is a 10% probability, 0.1 is 10%, that the CHP will conclude that the average car exceeds the speed limit, so that means we have concluded that HA is true, when in fact it does not. So when in fact H naught is true. Now let's interpret the p-value. So the p-value is 0 0.07 or 7%. The p-value is the probability that if H naught is indeed true, that we will by random chance obtain a result as rare or rarer than the result that was obtained in the study. So now let's write that down in words about this study. So we can say the if the average speed of the cars on Oak Street is 50 miles per hour, so that is if H naught is true, and if we sample the same number of cars repeatedly, then just 7%, that's the 0 0.07, of the samples will result in a sample mean greater than the sample mean that the CHP obtained. So finally, let's state our conclusion. So the important thing is that our p-value, which is 0 0.07, is less than 0.1, or p is less than alpha. And when p is less than alpha, we reject the null hypothesis and accept the alternative hypothesis. So the CHP can state that the mean speed on Oak Street is greater than 50 miles per hour. And I'm done with the problem.